iDevices has made it simple to install your Instinct. In a few short steps, you'll transform your existing wall switch into a connected wall switch with built-in Alexa. Depending on your setup, you will need a Phillips head screwdriver and a flathead screwdriver. A voltage detector is required for identifying your existing wiring, and pliers are helpful in straightening out old wires. In the box, you will find the parts you need for installation, the Instinct wiring guide, faceplate, wall plate, and a few wire nuts. Instinct works in a single pole setup. A single pole setup is when one light switch controls one set of lights. If you have multiple light switches controlling one set of lights, you have a multi-way setup, and Instinct is not compatible at this location. Instinct must be installed in a manner that conforms to all applicable national, state, and local building codes. If you are unclear at any point, please contact the iDevices customer experience team. Turn off the power at your breaker or fuse panel for the appropriate circuit of your home. Turn the existing light switch on, then off, to confirm the power has been turned off. Remove the existing faceplate. Unscrew and pull the switch carefully out of the gang box. Make sure you have a neutral wire junction in the gang box. This is typically a bundle of white wires grouped together. If your gang box doesn't contain a neutral wire, Instinct is not compatible at this gang box location. Excluding the green or bare copper ground wires, if you have more than two wires connected to your switch, you may have a multi-way configuration in which Instinct is not compatible. Take a photo of your existing wiring for future reference. Disconnect the old switch. Turn the power back on at the breaker. Before installing Instinct, let's identify the wires in the gang box. Neutral wires will usually be white and are often bundled together. The ground wire is usually bare copper or green. To easily identify the load and line wires, both usually black, use a voltage detector. The energized wire is the line wire. Note this wire for reference and mark with tape if it's helpful. The wire that is not energized is the load wire. Note this wire for future reference as well. Turn the power back off at the breaker. Straighten out the wires. Instinct's wires are labeled on the back for easy identification. Connect the red load wire on Instinct to the load wire you removed from the previous switch. Connect the black line wire on Instinct to the line wire you removed from the previous switch. This was the energized wire you noted previously. Remove the wire nut from the white neutral wire bundle in the gang box and attach Instinct's white neutral wire to that grouping of wires. Finally, connect the green ground wire on Instinct to the ground wires in the gang box. Ensure the wire caps are securely fastened and carefully push the wires into the gang box, taking care not to pinch any wires. Screw Instinct into the gang box. Install the wall plate, followed by the face plate. Instinct fits any standard size rocker faceplate, so you may choose to select one that's best for your home. Turn the power back on at the breaker and confirm that the Alexa ring lights up blue and begins to spin. Congratulations, your Instinct is now installed. Launch the Instinct Switch app to be guided through the final setup and link your Amazon account. If you want to learn more about Instinct or need additional help, head over to iDevicesInc.com support.